Hi there, once again, welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to install Essential Graphics in Adobe Premiere Pro. I've downloaded some Essential Graphics and I want to show you how to install this in Adobe Premiere Pro. I have some lower text effect and I really want to add them to my Adobe Premiere. Okay, so these are the text presets. I have them over here and I really want to show you how to add those ones. Okay, so these are the text preset I have. So I'm going to show you and uh, walk you through how to do that. So in order to do this, within your tabs at the top, click on graphics. When you click on the graphics tab, it's going to open this essential graphics tab for you. And this is where you can add new graphics. Okay, this could be lower text fit for subscribe button, as you can see over here. So in order to add a new subscribe button, you just click on the plus icon at the far bottom. Click on that and it's going to open the dialog box for you. So you just have to navigate to where you have that file. In my case, I have it within what? My YouTube folder. That I have the text preset. So I can select any of them. So I'll select the text preset 10 and then click OK. So once this is added to it, you can easily use it. Just type the name in the search by icon because I've installed a lot. So I'll just type that text. So I'll just type this as text preset 10. So just search for that and I can see that over. I can see then in text preset 10. So if you want to use this in your design, just drag this on top of your work. Okay. And it's going to load this. You may not have the required font, but you can easily change the font at any time. You can see I have a missing font, but I'll use my own font to do that. So just confirm that. And you can just play this to see how it's going to look like. Oops. So once you can see my presets showing, you can easily edit this anytime at all you want. So in order to do this, make sure your preset is select on your timeline. And you can see we have the text presets. You can change the font to any font at all you want to buy. So just type on the text preset and then change the name from there. So I'm going to type a different name. So I've changed the name and I can change the font as well. So there are several fonts over you can select from here. If you choose to increase the size, you can do that. So you can check that from your timeline over here. You can see everything is showing over here. If you choose to increase the size, of your preset you can do that the color as well you can change that you can change the color from here so if you add this kind of preset you can easily do your modification so you can play and then check how this is going to look like so let me just play this you can is So you can see how my text preset is showing. So this method can help you add any text preset at all you want. I have some lower text effect I can also add. So when I click on the plus icon, maybe I want to include some subscribe button. You can easily do that. So in this case, I'll go back to my YouTube folder and then I'll just locate a new folder here. That is, I have some subscribe icons I want to use. So I have several ones with a subscribe button. I want to include that in my design. I'll just select that and then open this. So anytime you add it, just make sure you go ahead and what search for that. So you can see I have down one down over here. If you want to include that subscribe button, I have another one at the top of I've already added some. So any of them that you want to use, once you add it, it will show over here, and then you can drag it on top of your design. Okay. You can subscribe, you can add it to your design, and you can just play around it. And then you can do modification to that. Very high. Look at in that information people are searching for also how to. So you can see I have it here. It's showing right here. I've added a preset. If I want to do any modification to reduce the size, I can equally go to the edit icon and then with this selected, I can go to the edit icon and then change the word subscribe and also do modification to that. 
So basically, this is how to add a uh, preset or essential graphics to your design work. Remember to like, subscribe, and then turn on the notification bell because I have a lot coming up on this channel. I'm going to show you a lot of strategy, a lot of tips, and a lot of editing techniques. So like and share this video as well. Till I come away again. Bye-bye.